So I'm gonna be your host, Zach Garner. First, can you guys make some noise for my man on the ones and twos back here, DJ Mix16. Give him a round of applause. I mentioned I needed four dancers. Raise your hand if you think you can dance. One second here, one second. I got too much money. All right, here we go. Let's see, and the winner of the dance competition at $100 is contestant number four! Good. All right, there we go, there's 100 bucks. Give my man a round of applause. He was spinning on his head. Tornado Blue Man Sharks, all right, there's the first top three. All right, here we go. Next question, what is the SI unit of magnetic flux? Where's my science people at? You know it? What do you think it is? Yeah, dude, nice. Is it one, three, or five? Is it Weber's or Pulse's? It's number three, Weber's! Hey, Internet, you may have heard about New York City's historic menstrual equity bill, which ensures women access to menstrual products in schools, shelters, and correctional facilities. After all these years, we can finally say, all periods are created equal. Ugh. What? Disgusting. Bleh. No, it's not disgusting. A woman's body, they're beautiful flowers. And once a month, they shed their uterine petals, often in a field. No, and... stop talking. Welcome back to LIB TV. I'm your host, Zach Garner. And in related news on how local government is keeping up with the times, New York Attorney General is now cracking down on fake Yelp reviews, which I think is an overreach of power, because as Americans, we have the right to say we found some mouse droppings in the soup because the cute waitress sauna won't give me her number. The government shutdown wasn't all bad. They did, however, shut down a KKK rally, and people can no longer get gun permits, which is exactly what they don't need. We've got the Hamptons Classic Horse Show. First hundred people get a monocle and a foreclosed home. Last four horses get euthanized. With it being back to school season, there's a market for glue. Ooh. So. The first case of West Nile virus has been found on Long Island. Local health department says we don't need to worry about West Nile. Clearly they're in denial. <laughs> this Saturday in Roosevelt at Western Beef is the African American parade. You'll find me there dancing off beat. This is why, this is why, this is why I'm hot, hot, I'm hot cause I'm fly. So that's all your news and events on Long Island. Thanks for joining us here at LIB TV. For more info, go to LIBmagazine.com. And don't forget to check out our Facebook, our Twitter, our Instagram. And here is the Instagram clip of the week.